back. Alright, from where we left off, we were naming this button in the beef menu. This is going to be RDB underscore, let's say, S steak. SDA SDEA steak. This is under the beef menu. Okay. And then we'll just select them. We're not gonna do anything with them. You could work on doing that yourself. I'm just showing you how to get the card method working. Alright, and we're just gonna put a button here which will just simply take us back to the main menu. Menu. Right, that's done. Let's go with the chicken. Chicken. All right. This time, let's use it. Keep it consistent. You don't want to do too much. Complicate everybody. And a button that takes us back to the menu. All right. Oh, let's see what this says. Button, menu, I wanted to say underscore. This is under the beef panel, right? Radio button, RDB. You can name it whatever you want, but I like naming it something that I can remember easily, or that I always use. I have my consistent naming convention. RDB, radio button. Um, no, what is, this is under the chicken, what am I doing? Chicken. Chicken. Let's get um, Bobby Bob Q. And, oh no, I like to keep them Bobby Q on the score. It's under the chicken. All right, and let's just put barbecue here. We'll name it barbecue. And this one, you say RDB underscore, um, what kind of chicken can we put in it? Chicken sandwich, chick. I'm just gonna put, um, this is under the, Chicken menu. All right, and we have a chick. Chick witch. Chick witch. Okay, chick witch. Chicken sandwich. Okay, so we have that laid out. So we have a chicken laid out, we have our beef menu laid out, and we have the main menu laid out. Okay, so with that, let's take a short commercial break, and we go to the next video.